Warning, the following video contains what is possibly the most useless creation you have ever seen in your life. Alright guys, Jamal116 back with another redstone creation. As my lovely intro implied to you there, I've made something pretty useless, but you know, it's pretty cool, so I'm going to show you guys anyways. Basically, what I've done is I've made a mechanism which starts at 1 and doubles, so you see we have the 1 down there. It's going to double down to, then to 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, and so on, all the way up to a Google. Now, if you don't know what that is, a Google is a 1 followed by 100 zeros, it's 10 by 10. So I've got 100 digits set up here, and obviously we're not going to hit exactly a Google, but we are going to hit above a Google. So my goal is that I'm just going to set it on automatic, and it's just going to start at 1 and keep doubling up until it reaches a Google. And so, as you can see, I've got a double subjective in the sidebar over there, and we're going to see how many times we have to double before we reach a Google. So this is insane. I really haven't actually done the whole thing at once yet. You can see I, I kind of stopped around the third row there. So... We're going to see how this works. Hopefully I don't have to do this too much. There's not that much wrong with it, hopefully. But it's really all there is, so we're just going to get on into the video. I'm going to cut out and do the time lapse. We're going to see how many doubles and how long it takes to double to get to a Google. And I guess let's just get right into it.
Alright, so I hope that my um, commentary over the time lapse was mildly entertaining for you guys. Unfortunately, well, a couple things happened when I went to record it. One, this computer here that I'm on now is not actually strong enough to handle a Google doubling over and over again, so I actually had to go up to my dad's computer upstairs that he works on that is a lot more powerful to actually record this. So, that's why I don't have the number here to show you. The other issue that I had was that my mechanism to stop it when it reached to Google wasn't exactly working right. So I went a couple doubles above what it took to get to a Google. Now I know this, I don't know the exact number, but I know it was over 350 doubles, which is 2 to the power of around 350 to get to a Google. So those of you who make redstone computers, you know what my new standard is. 350 bits. I better see it next time. But that being said, I thought it was insane the computer could even handle it, and I must say it was really fun. Well, fun might be a bit of a strong word given the amount of issues. I had to re-record this, this thing ten times because it kept not working. And so you know what, I, I, if, if there's anything wrong with it, I'm not re-recording it. We're just, we're, I'm just posting it. Screw it. So, that being said, it was a lot of fun to make in reality, and I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Just kind of a cool video. It doesn't play a game, it's not useful, but it is a lot of fun just to watch, especially because the thing goes so fast. It's kind of fun to just all the numbers disappear, and then all of a sudden they're numbers again. It's really entertaining. Anyways, that's all I've got for you guys today. So until next time, Jamal116, signing out.